Oh, hi there. How are you, gentlemen? Welcome to your Universalist 3 Let's Play. With your host, Shenrer, we have some housekeeping to do before I go to work. There was a very good suggestion on dealing with my complete fail of memory on how centers of trade work, and that our national focus wasn't enough to build a center of trade. We also had to have a uh, the place where I wanted to build a center of trade had to be in uh, a center of trade area that had a value over 800. And I forgot to check the center of trade area over here. And it looks like we're all trading through freely. So what we're going to do is uh, embargo freely and see if that will remove all these lands from their center of trade. It should. And then we'll see which center of trade it becomes under. Let's see. Uh, Shimbargo against Achillea, thereby ban their, their traders from our centers of trade. Wait a minute, so it's only a one-way embargo? So that embargoes them from trading in our centers of trade. But does that stop us from trading in theirs? Probably not. Let's take a look. Oh, what else was going on? Yeah, someone said to check our borders. <clears throat> Excuse me, to see if Prussia had a core on our territory. And no, they do not. They're just being dickholes. Because that's what Prussia does. They're, they're just dickholes. But we're going to keep trying to impress them. So, yeah. Anti-Piracy Act, we're not doing that. Speed of succession, we're not doing that. Revolt risk is going down. Hooray truces are expiring all over the map. We eventually need to go to war with Syria and uh, the Mamluks. And the Chopinids don't really care. They're at war with Ming right now, although they can't reach them. They're at war with a lot of shit they can't reach. Someone is conquering Japan. Kara Kyunlu is conquering Japan's possessions over here. Interesting. Anyway, we were colonizing these islands. We're going to keep that up for sure, because that's fucking boss. And these guys are getting converted, which is awesome. What I want to do down here is release uh, another vassal. And give them the authority to, to uh, be the orthodox power in this part of Africa. And maybe we'll hold on to little bits and pieces here and there. But for the most part, I want vassals. Whoa, why are you so depleted? Let us fund you for a little bit. Ah, uh, yeah, white piece, whatever. Whoa, Bohemia. Bohemia. Oh, Bohemia and Austria at war. Wurzenberg and Sicily. Austria. Ooh, we could totally join this on Bohemia's side. We could force Austria to spit out some shits. We could also force them to go orthodox. Ooh, that's tempting. Anyway, how's our centers of trade doing? No, we're still trading through Fiuli. So, yeah, that embargo thing doesn't work unless they embargo you back. And looks like they have not embargoed us back. So that was still a waste of a center. That was a waste of a national focus. Because we can't move it again for 25 years, which is just so lame, but whatever. Okay. Stability's up. Good, good. Oh yeah, we are really close to getting our, na our army uh, modernized, by the way. We need... Uh, stability of 3, we're at 2. We need centralization at negative 5, which is only one more step. So the next slider change, which is in 7 years. And then we also need da, 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 resist westernization to be gone. And I have no idea when this will go away. Yeah, it doesn't say when it'll be gone. Oh, there it does. Yeah, 1546. So next year. 
So we'll see if we can hold on after we get that back. And yeah, we're... Mom looks to join Mali in a war against Syria. Huh. Interesting. Ethiopia, Chobanids, guaranteed by the Mamluks. Oh, you guys are allied with the Chobanids? Interesting. What about you? Chobanids is a defender of the faith. Damn it. Conan born in Syria. Yeah. We'll have to wait on that until someone else is a defender of the faith. Don't really want to go to war with the Chobanids right now. I mean, it's not the end of the world if we did, but I don't want to. So there. Yeah, it looks like Bohemia is just marching in. They got one already. They annexed Thuringia. Of course they did, because they're becoming blobby bastards. Oh, goodness. And they just lost an army here, because they didn't want to, to I guess. We do need more generals. Actually, we have five. That's probably enough generals. Ah, new cannons. We have the Culverin. The next one is the Chamber Demi Cannon. Yeah, a little less morale, but it's stronger, so we'll take it. We're also going to fund our Navy. Still making some dollars, which is good. And let's see, what are you doing? Yeah, okay. We'll let Bohemia deal with a lot of your military power, because their army is better than our army. Like, they have better units. So we'll do that. And then while uh, while they're invading your north, we will invade your south and Italy. And we'll hopefully make you spit out people like Trent and Mantua. Yeah, Mantua would be both of these territories. Good, good. We can make you spit out Venice again, which we've already done. Man. Oh, there we go. Now we have successfully embargoed with them. Okay. So it is working now. But it's not valued enough for me to make my own center of trade, because now we're trading through Venice. It's just not a good enough center of trade. Oh, goodness. Well, we could demand to annex Ragusa. Oh, that's right. We tried. That's what we did at the end of the last episode. We tried, and they said no. Well, not going to worry about it right this second. Anyway, Bohemia and Austria. Looks like Bohemia is going to win that battle. Yeah. So we're going to bring some troops up. You guys go to Trieste. Why don't you stay along the coast and not take attrition, you dumb motherfuckers? You guys go to Karlovac. You guys go to Dalmatia. Can I afford another army? I do not have room for another army. Damn it. I kind of want another army. Well, we'll have to deal without it. You guys go to there and just chill. Put speed all the way up. See if we can get in position. generals died. Damn it. Fuck it. Just get another general. Oh, he's good. It's 464. Wow. And we have a colonist. Hooray. Let's keep colonizing over here. Because these are awesome. Where's our navy? Up here? Yeah. You've got a decent admiral. He's okay. 
Not like we'll need it against Austria, but we'll bring it over anyway, just in case they have a navy somewhere. Ooh, 50% infamy for annexing provinces. I like that. And you get more prestige. Not like we need more prestige. It says Burgundy will protect them. Yeah, England will join. That's fine. We're almost in position. Whoa, Crane has a support limit of 35. Holy shit. Nice. Uh, looks like they don't have a navy over there, so we'll check over here in Modena. Alright, you're in position. Good, good. Okay, we're ready to invade. Let's get this shit started. Cleansing of heresy. The allies will join. England join. Burgundy join. Okay, so Burgundy's the war leader. Sucks to be you. Corsica, Muscovy, Bar, blah, 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 blah. England should keep Burgundy busy for a while, but because they have some lands that border them. But for the most part, we're going to be fighting Burgundy. We can't call them to war. Not sure why. We'll give them some dollars, make them happy again. that oh Piscov declared independence from Muscovy right in that peace deal okay died. Well, good thing we can do another one. Well, yeah, we'll get another one. No reason to not have enough generals. Oh, we got there in time. We have a negative six, though. We still won. Arts Academy, okay. We got there first. Now they have a negative six. Good, good. And that army's dead. So we're going to split up. You guys are going to go this way. already. Ha <laughs> ha. Fat chance, my friends.
Burgundy's here. Look at that. I didn't even notice. Alright, let's go kill Burgundy. Sounds like fun. Level 2 forts. Oh shit, we need to start building again. Yeah. Uh, do anything here? Some level 2s. Level 2 in our capital is a good idea. There we go. Missionaries. Do we need to missionize anywhere? I don't think so. No, we're already doing all the missionizing we can. Can we spend a missionary? Uh, stability cost goes down. That's kind of tempting. For just a tiny bit less national tax, stability cost goes down permanently. I think we're going to do that, because I like stability a lot, so yeah. What's our war score with Austria? 25%. Oh, shit. Who's this? Corsica wants peace. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't really care about Corsica. Actually, can we, uh... No, we can't convert you for only 25. No, we'd have to actually land troops. We'll get... No, they won't get, how about some dollars? They won't give us shit. Alright, just white piece is fine. Just get out of the war. Ow. No, I do not like attacking in the mountains. Not at all. Defending in the mountains is fun. Anyway, you guys are just going to repair. That's good. Oh shit, I'm going to lose that army. Not good. Oh, they're, they're going to get the end of the month bonus. They're fine. Yeah. Access, thank you. Oh, fail siege. We're gonna have to bring up another army. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Admiral's concerned. Yeah, what did they know? Renounce their claims. No, we can do better than that, Austria. I want you to... S well, you won't convert yet, but I also want you to spit out some people. Ah, oh, shit. We're out of time in this recording. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed our time together today. I unfortunately have to get to work, so this war will have to wait for another time. But yeah, we'll try to finish this shit up. This siege is going to take a while, so let's just bring the Hurt Army home. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Please comment if you have some suggestions, rate if you enjoyed this, and uh, subscribe if you want to see more of my bullshit, because I do have a lot of bullshit to share with you clowns. Alright, bye-bye everybody.